So, here we go. Sticky grenades, beautiful figures. They look so much better now. The light has actually, like, the sun's come out a little bit, so way, way better. These are just gorgeous figures, man. Like, absolutely gorgeous. I'm honestly sad that these are the last time I'm ever gonna see them. Like, this new articulation Hayabusa is phenomenal. Look at that, man. And you say that's a, that's an old mold head? Yep, old Hayabusa. Old Hayabusa head just on a really nice body. Is that a JFO shoulder? Mm -hmm. We've got a nice plain uh, chest, but like the detailing is really fun. Silver weathering can be hit or miss. You can have things like the fire team Osiris with way too much, or you can have some that don't have any at all. This is the perfect amount, you know? Very light, dry brushing, and then some more intentional brushing like the DMR and the torso, just leading all the way up to a very clean head. And the color choices on that head are really interesting, like that cream like beige is not what I would have chosen, but that's because I, I don't have a good enough imagination for this thing. Like that's the perfect color. And then we move on to this Gungnir. Oh my Lord, this is nice, right? Like I've been a big fan of the Halo Infinite Gungnirs. I love the one from the Builder's Box particularly, but this is so dope. And you say, does he have a cosplay with needles sticking yes. out? Yes, so these are based off of his two cosplay armors that he has made. Wow, I'm uh, gonna have Sergeant to put them Skittles. on the screen. Mm -hmm. Sergeant Skittles, yeah. Yep. So these customs are by Sticky Grenade and they're for Sergeant Skittles. You can follow them both on Instagram. I'll leave them as a pinned comment. Just marvelous, man. Look at that pink detailing on the, I just noticed that on yep. his arm. That's really dope. Also, these pieces are uh, from the Tesla Cybertruck, which is a bit of a weird thing. Yeah, we just dropped the Tesla off with Rob at Brick Stuff. Uh, he's gonna be custom fitting it with some lights and sounds. So we don't need any of these pieces that we used for the primary build. I thought I may as well make a display base so I could show these two off. And then what do we have down here, Strandy? That is an alternative helmet for the uh, Hayabusa because he has two different helmets he has for that cosplay and I Damn. wanted to make sure I got it for him. I mean, what a gift to this guy. Like he buys a custom off you when you're 13 and spends $70 yeah. and in return you make two custom Spartans that are literally his cosplay configurations. That's badass, man. And then that blue highlighting. I love me a good painted energy sword any day, but this one has particularly nice blue. What? I just said energy sword? <laughs> what? You said energy sword. I love myself a good painted gravity hammer, and these blue spots give it a nice charging effect. All in all, this is a flawlessly executed double custom job. I really like that sort of, that's very Carter-esque, right, yep. on that shoulder. And then uh, some basic detailing. Pink needles. And the pink needles are probably what green stuff yeah some kind of putty well done sticky grenade and the chest piece man yeah there's a lot to talk about with this build great job sticky grenade you did a flawlessly executed piece of work here yes. like i'm very impressed so everybody go follow sticky grenade on instagram and you all have a great day you stay awesome you stay safe out there folks and strandy's head is signing off